Hello everyone, welcome to part 4 of my um, Oblivion Rares. Um, this is for a blade called Umbra, and also, it's also a way to get every armor at any level, so including level 1, I'm level 3 as you can see. So, you know, it's proof as well that you can get ebony armor now. Right now, okay. You, what you've got to go to is you've got to go to a, an aid room called Vindacell, here at the Imperial City. So you can just go from the waterfront district and then walk to here. Yeah, if you want to mark your map. Okay. Then what you do is you're going to just walk down here. Oh, and you, I'm going to warn you, uh, this is a really hard fight, especially if you're, low if you're low level. So that's why I put the difficulty down to the very minimum, because it is still a really hard fight, and I'm not going to joke about it. It is a really hard fight at a low level. If you're level 20, then just do the um, day group quest. Because it's part of a danger quest when you go get this blade. It also weighs nothing though as well if you don't do the quest. And it's quite heavy if you don't do the quest. If you do the quest, sorry. Anyway. There's nothing really hard to be just you know, rats and stuff. Um so she's it down there. There she is. See, there she's right there. Um what I would recommend doing is I wouldn't charge it right now and attack her. What I want to do is here she is. So I want to sneak up behind her, like this, and then attack her like that. And see that's just done a little bit of damage to her, sneak damage. Block. Use a different. You should use a shield and a sword. So I would only recommend doing this if you're a warrior and if you're good at the game. If you've just started the game, don't do this. And make sure you've got loads of health potions on you as well. Oh dear. See what I mean? She's really hard and stuff. So. Yeah, her blade is really good as well. This blade doesn't get better if you level up, so it's also really a really good way to pimp yourself up at level one. You know, you'll just be like an ebony walking level, you know, Umbra slaying level one character. She's almost dead now. Oh dear. Oh, my sword's gone. Drop my sword. There we are. Okay. Now she's dead. Okay. Pick up our armor. It is really heavy though, you know. Let's see how I'm over encumbered. Um one we're gonna do now is drop my stuff. Okay. So I would recommend dropping pretty much everything you've got or until you know, pretty much drop everything all the armor you've got. As you can see. Here it is, and the sword and brother is the thing you really want to get. Here it is. So as you can see, I'm a uh, pimpy, very pimpy. Um, now the sword. It's really good. It it does. Self trap for 120 seconds on the strike, and it does 13 damage, and that's really good for, good for me at the moment, um, because you do more damage, you know, when you land with your blade skill. So, and my and a steel blade, which is the average blade for me right now, does five damage. So you know, it's, it's it's probably the best sword on the game. Actually, it is the best sword on the game. A bit better look at it. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe, and look up for part five.